Okay, hello YouTube, Catman here. Today I went to the landfill again, and I didn't film much anything there, so... Now I'm gonna do... I'm just doing this intro, and then I'm gonna do the review, okay? Bye! Okay, and I'm back. Now I'm gonna do the review. It wasn't the best finds ever today, but it was pretty interesting, so yeah. There's this cup, which is Hazel Alice, which I have a um, small collection of. Hazel Alice stuff has a few things, like six or seven things at least. And there's this cork top. All it says is full pint. And number five on the bottom. If you can ID this, please let me know. Thank you. Oh, it's not focusing. It says five on there. I was holding it up to now. I say, believe that's a cork top. So, yeah. Probably old. And this, I have a, just got a glass engraver recently. So, I'm just going to clean this off and engrave it because it's plain. Don't worry. It's like 1970s. So... Yeah, 1978, so not too old. This is this giant one-gallon jug. Which, I'm not sure how old that is either. I haven't read the bottom yet or anything. That could have information. But, I'm probably going to keep this and use it for, like, storing coins or something. Yeah. And this one I'm probably going to throw out. It's a screw top jug. Don't know how what the measurement is for this one. Probably, like, a... Not a pint, uh, I don't know the measurements, like half a gallon, maybe. Probably can store it out, because there's, there's, like, residue inside, like, moss, mold. It's way too hard to clean, so I'm not going to keep that one. And this one's huge, but I have a use for it, so yeah. And then this little milk jug, which is probably the find of the day, it says... Delaware Famous... I mean, not Famous. Delaware Farms Incorporated. And it has its address. Has a D on it. So it's the same thing on the other side. And then it says New York City. Don't know the year. I'll have to research that. Well, hope you enjoyed. But goodbye.